I'm gonna share it with you what I took it with me while I was in Europe and this time is gonna be skincare that's the cosmetic bag from one of the Sup and Glory sets so I have the pixie toner as you see it's already empty it's with AHA then I have another one from Paula's Choice with BHA moisturizer from Estee they were I went through many through many of those and I do like it Tell balm, 10 balm from Indeed Lab it's one of those things which you cannot go wrong with and it does re repair your skin then from Este Micro Essence this is like their version of SK2 Paula's Choice Glow Moisturizer with SPF 30 this one has a little bit of color but it was okay then hand cream from okay this brand it's nice it performs well then i have intense reset concentrate similarly as with this when your skin needs something extra this one works then i have the regular advanced night repair which i use for years the anr for the eyes it's awesome then from sunday rally not not you where you at just fell out from sunday rally i have their 15 percent vitamin c and i did use it however no i didn't like it i didn't like it vitamin c should be good for pigmentation but my pigmentation show up more so now i'm using something else in order to bring it to the way how it was a toothpaste toothbrush another toothpaste we don't need to see that cleanser from orgies i do like it it's foaming cleanser i went through many 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 of those perfume okay i don't know what is this but it smells like gardenia then the retinol capsules from no that's vitamin c capsules from elizabeth arden little perfume from erin amber mask and that's exactly how it smells another advanced night repair serum from number seven product and perfect it's a small sample so i didn't see too many results but i did use it another vitamin c from sunday rally this is retinol from number seven it's good stuff i already have a big size of it this i do enjoy it it has an earthy smell that's the origins mega mushroom really resilience face serum so it's one of those things which you want to use where you don't know what else put on your skin when it's sensitive irritated and it's some help another anr for the eyes anr for the face another number seven serum i didn't even use this one because i don't know how it ended up over here that's retinol b3 from la roche posay i think i used it only once that's the olay eye lifting serum with a belief retinol i did use it i like it however because it's potent and eye area is really sensitive you don't want to use it every night i would say start no no every other one that's white tea serum from origins i do enjoy it and why i wear this it's when why i'm using this serum i don't put primer on before my makeup because my skin is so smooth then the what was it dermabrasion so it's like a peeling for your skin this is wonderful it's elizabeth arden the eight hour balm for your lips i went through many tubes of it and i do enjoy it it's like it's one of those luxury items which you cannot go wrong with then we have the eye capsules from ceramite yeah ceramite's eye serum clinic all about ice rich and yes it is rich i do like it because it's way thicker than the actual face cream and then from it cosmetics we have their beauty sleep which is if memory serves me right purple in color and has yep and has has a scent of a lavender it has a jelly texture and 
It's not bad. I'm not a lavender person, so I'm kind of glad it's over. Within those items, some of them are empty, so I'm going to put them into the empties bin and don't be surprised if you're going to see them, see them again. But yeah, that's what I brought with me and I see you next time. Bye!